We've been trying to have a baby for quite some time now. We've seen every doctor and specialist and nothing seems to be working. We didn't know what else to do. My wife and I were curious about your granddaughter's abilities. We just want to make sure that we don't... Get scammed. My husband's a bit skeptical. I feel your concern, darling, but I promise you, my granddaughter has the gift. Go on, sweetheart. Show this nice lady what you can do. I know what you're thinking. Why have these people come to see me? And what exactly are these abilities these folks are so curious about? You see, I've been living with a secret, and I learned this secret long ago. I'm done. I'm not going to be talked to like that in my own home. So you're just going to give up on this 30-year marriage? My daughter gave up on this family a long time ago, and maybe she's a smart one after all. So you're setting a real good example for your granddaughter. What's going on? I'm just going on a little trip, sweetie. Everything all right? Everything's just fine. It felt like a fever dream. Like I was transported through time. Except this wasn't a dream. It was reality. What's wrong, Grace? I think Granddaddy's gonna die. That was the first of many incidents. Eventually, people started talking, and even the local police wanted to get me involved. Stop resisting, you crazy son bitch! Is he our man? I don't know. Call the girl over here. That's him. No one wanted me around, but everyone somehow needed me. You guys are gonna have a happy, healthy baby. Then, one day, Cassie moved next door. Cassie was always the life of the party. She always had this infectious energy. You should totally come visit my sister with me in California. Mm, I don't know. Oh, come on. It would be so fun. <sighs> All right. Do you want to go to the park? You're into him, aren't you? I can tell. You want to meet him? Sean Taker? He's like a local skate legend. You know him? Sure I do. Uh, no, I'm too shy. Hey, Sean, get your ass over here. My pretty friend wants to meet you. Howdy, ladies. Oh, and I forgot to mention one thing. I freaking love Sean Taker. Y'all, watch me do this trick. You should touch him. Are you crazy? Walk into the future. Maybe you'll get married and have kids. Mm. Now's your chance. <clears throat> Here, let me help you with that. You always carry these? Have it.
babe, what are you doing here? I really can't hang out tonight. Do you love him? Honey. Sean, do you love him? I don't know where you'd get that idea. He's mine, you know. He's always been mine. All right. I need you to get out of my house. I've never been loved once in my entire life. And you are not going to take away the one person that brings me an ounce of happiness. Back off, freak. There was nothing that could come between me and him. Are you okay? She was my best friend. I know, sweetheart. Hey, I'm sure they'll catch you ever did. I don't understand. She's dead. How can this be happening? Be all right. Mrs. Johnson, my condolences. Thanks for coming, Sean. Of course. Grace, have you met Cassie's twin sister, Chloe? It's good to meet you. She's come all the way from California.